What was that? Um, what am I doing with my hands? Okay. So, for today's video, please like and subscribe because we are going to be painting on clothes. And I know it's a ridiculous idea, but why? Because it's unique, cool, and creative. But it's actually just for fun. So, yeah. Just to ease your boredom. Um, you need three things. So, basically, is three or three? I don't know. So all you need is some pair of jeans or some jumper pants that'll do and some acrylic paint, variety of colors. Oopsie. And some paintbrushes. Oh, okay, here are they. Okay, so these paintbrushes, like these kind of type. So number one, draw some sketches. For these right here, I have drawn a Polaroid camera and some Polaroids and down below, I've drawn the BDS21 Anong Asaya armies out there. So, for the next one, um, I've drawn some flowers, a bunch of flowers. Why? Because it's, you know, almost spring. Duh. <laughs> okay. But um, down below, I've drawn some wings and yeah another wing so yeah um but i ended up choosing well a little choosing the flower type so let's get on with the video <laughs> I am painting the back pockets white but if you're not so sure please use some scotch tapes to avoid any marks stains or paint on the sides of your denim pocket while painting and don't forget to mix fabric medium with paint so that you would have a flexible texture while applying paint on your clothing because if you don't apply fabric medium with that paint it would end up having a stiff hard kind of texture when you let it dry up so it is important if you have a fabric med medium right by your side and use it and apply it quickly guys i am finally done at painting 
these things out. I've painted this once with two white back pockets and the other one light yellow and light blue. But seriously though, it took me kind of one hour to finish these things. Why do you ask? Because um, the fabric, it keeps sucking all of the paint and it sucks, you know? But um, I'm glad that I'm finished and um, for the next step that I'm going to do, I'm going to be sketching some pencil and yeah, and then I'll be painting again for the second time. So here is some work in progress. The sun is literally too bright. Like it's so bright outside that I can't even see the outlines where I'm painting. So I am using an art line kind of thing marker. A water, uh, wait, can you focus please? Focus, focus. Wait, so there it is. It's um, a pigment ink, water-based, water resistant so that if you put it in the laundry, that it won't get removed.
so um here it is i've basically painted um a violet and the other one looks like a trumpet creeper of how it is named but surprisingly i am satisfied with the end result of the trumpet creepers i really loved how it turned out and how the colors beautifully was blended and for this one it was terribly horrifying like oh my gosh no it's not the end result that i've wanted so i'm going to be revising it again and spice things up a bit So, I am finally done! Oh, oh my god! It actually turned out pretty good! 
it was worth the time and effort and I love every single detail but if I were to choose one I would choose the trumpet creepers because it stands out and if I have three words for this it would be beautifully aesthetically satisfying I love every single detail like the little bud right here it's so adorable and that's it So for all of the armies who are out there and are watching this video, yes, you have guessed it right. It is the BTS 21 characters, Koya and Jimmy basically from RM and from Jimin. But I don't know why exactly have I chosen these two. Maybe it's just easy to draw. And this is also a solution for you armies out there for someone you know who is broke or not basically broke but for someone who is asking for their parents to buy them some bts merch but you're actually not getting the dream that you wanted to have you know just grab some pants grab some shirt or any kind of clothing and turn them into a bts merch or some bts 21 merch and you have it Since there is a pandemic coronavirus out there, make sure to follow these steps. Remember to wash your hands every single time when you touch something. Wash them thoroughly, the back of your hands, between your fingers, under the nails, and enough time to sing happy birthday twice for 20 seconds. Remember, if you're using a mask, you should throw them away once they feel gross because bacteria grows inside and outside of the mask. So remember to throw it them away. For the next one, do not share your food, utensils, cups and towels, and for each and every meal, use a serving spoon, please. And everyone should get their own towel for hygiene purposes. Open and close the doors with your elbows or shoulders instead of hands if possible because you can't touch your face with your elbow even if you try. And finally, always wash your hands 
with soap before and after you eat or being out in the public. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please give a big thumbs up or a thumbs down so that I would know which content you prefer. Thank you guys for all your love and support. Bye bye!